Hey guys, it's Bug, and I'm here to tell you how to make SSBAB custom songs for Brawl. Wow. Anyway, what you need is obviously a song, a sound editing software, Brawl Box, and a way to know how to name your file. So, let's get started. How to get your song? That's up to you. So anyway, we open up our song editing software. I'm sick, I'm sorry. File. Wait, you should open up your song. By the way, this is a new this is this is a new custom song that I'm gonna add. Still sick. Anyway, the first thing you need to do is erase the silence. That's a big silence. And then after you erase the silence, amplify the song. If it's a stereo sound wave, I put it to 3.0, and then if it's a mono sound wave, I put it to 4.0. Okay, let's try that out. Should be fine. Now save it as a WAV file. Leave these blank. Alright. Now that we made our WAV file, let's close this. No. Open up Brawl Box. It's lagging. File. New BRSTM audio stream and then find the file that you just made. Still sick. So this is the part where you start looping the song. The yellow bar is where the loop is gonna start. And the red bar is where the song is going to end. No matter where you move the yellow bar... <coughs> sorry. No matter where you move the yellow bar, the song will always start at the beginning, so don't worry. Most songs that, you're, most songs that you want are usually going to be looping songs, so leave that enabled. Unless it's a victory theme, just... Keep this checked. You'll... As a preview, it just check here. Play the song. Alright, let's find a point to where you to move the yellow bar. Then we do the same thing to the red bar. I just fast forwarded just so you know. Test that out. Wow, that was lag. <laughs> Sound lag. That's still way off. Are you serious? Is that a perfect try? <laughs> okay, so anyway, if it still doesn't sound right, play with the numbers. The higher the number, the more it goes to the end of the song. So if it's early, you might want to move the number up, and if it's late, move the number down. Okay, I think that'll work. So once you're done, you click OK. It's encoding right now. And then there's a little preview right here. Okay.
Okay, so anyway, this is where you're gonna find use this list. I'll give you a link in the description. So this list is organized by series. I want to change um, against the Black Knight, which is in Fire Emblem. It's right here. You find the name, and then on the left you'll see a letter, and then a number that contain two di digits. I don't know what this one's about. Why? I don't know why this has three digits, but anyway. So I want to change against the Black Knight. Right here it says J09, so that's why I'm going to name the song. J09. File, save as J09.brstm. It's important to add .brstm because if you didn't, it will end up as a WAV file. Go to your SD card, private, Wii, app, RSPE, PF, sound, STRM. I got a lot here. Save it. So anyway, after saving it to your SD card, that should be it. I'm going to go test it out right now. Okay, so I've edited the song right here, Castle Siege. I changed against the Dark Knight. Don't tell me how I changed the song name, so bear with me. There it is. And how will it work on the actual game? I'll show you. By having CPUs brawl. Yay! Texture specifically. I like the textures. They're from friends. Um... Let's have Zan in there. And Bell Bros. So let's see how this works out. So I'll just um, change the name of the song later. For now, I'll just enjoy the CPU as well. Okay?
the winner.